One thing that seems to give people a degree of difficulty is putting the uh, aileron horn and the, uh, the uh, rib there for the aileron horn in. Now, to drill the holes, to pre-drill the holes, you want to set it up so that these here are perpendicular or parallel with the rear spar and about a quarter of an inch back if you're using a piano hinge like on the FP202. And once you get those holes drilled, well actually you'll have to wait until you finish getting it slipped in and you barely, you don't want pressure on that. You don't want it bowed or anything. You want it to barely fit in snugly, a light snug. And basically the only thing you can do is get the basic angle cut all the way to the full size down below this spar to where the ribs would run. And then back here, do your half inch high where it meets up with this. That's going to stay the same. The only thing you change is this here angle and you just got to keep on chopping it back, cutting out these notches and just a little bit at a time until it slides in there just perfectly. Now one other thing I noticed on several of the wings that I've taken apart that are very old and lasted a long time is that people have butt jointed this geodetic to this here spar, to the horn spar. And uh, I was really surprised how strong it was and how difficult it was to pull off. I don't trust that though, so I'm putting little blocks in along with it, but it's much easier than trying to cut a slot and then block in where the slot was too big and try to get a piece of geodetic to go the full distance through that. That's a lot of work and very difficult. This was very fast and based on what I found from those butt joints, which I never trust an end grain joint, but uh, they seem to be pretty strong. I figure with these little blocks in it, it'll be good. I also took my uh, my backing piece of wood strengthener here. It normally just goes behind where the horn attaches. I took it the full length. It's made out of commercial white ash, a very thin piece, right on the back, right on the side of the uh, of the um, plywood. And then of course you just block this in. I block it in going right into the uh, geodetic slot and then put another little block on top of it.